Back to topic number three. And this one I've been wanting to talk about. <laughs> Drop the bomb! <laughs> Drop the bomb! We pimped your ride, Mr. <laughs> Tim Westwood TV. Right, I'm going to read. I don't usually read. Well, what's the topic about first? Well, just told me. I just told you. Oh, okay. um, Tim Westwood, sexual <laughs> misconduct claims. <laughs> Appalling! I don't like the way he said sexual. You would like to be fair. Appalling, says the BBC head. Uh, where does this come from? And this right? comes from, where's it coming from? The no, Guardian. No, the Guardian. Reputable mm. in the UK. Yeah. Anyway, the Director General of the BBC has described sexual misconduct claims made against the former Radio 1 DJ Tim Westwood. Appalling and urged anyone with evidence to come forward. Start snitching. That's what he's saying. <laughs> Tim Davey who is head of the radio output at the BBC when Westwood was the voice of rap and hip-hop on London, Radio 1, called the allegations shocking. Absolutely shocking. But he said he'd seen no evidence of the complaints being made by the DJ at the BBC. On Wednesday, two venues cancelled scheduled appearance, appearances, appearances by... Westwood, after a number of women accused him of misusing his position in the music industry to try and take advantage of them. Following a joint investigation into the former BBC Radio 1 DJ and The Guardian and the BBC, Westwood has strenuously, now I need to say strenuously, denied all the allegations. A spokesperson said the claims were completely false. Absolutely false. You know, go figure. <laughs> anyway, asked whether the BBC had any records of formal complaints about Westwood. He said, I've seen no evidence of complaints. I've asked, we've looked, our records. <clears throat> There's nothing there. Every complaint has to be taken seriously. If anything comes up, we will be investigating it fully. If people have evidence where things weren't followed up or have any concerns in this area, bring it to us. We will follow up anything and we'll dig and dig and dig. If people have got evidence of wrongdoing, bring it forward. Well, they're, they're, they're really like mm. asking people mm. to, it's like crime stoppers, <laughs> you know? Davy added, there's nothing worse in life than abuse of power. It's about values, setting the right culture and putting leaders in place. It's completely unacceptable, he said. Global radio has come under pressure to respond to the allegations of sexual misconduct made about Westwood after three women accused the DJ of opportunistic and predatory sexual behaviours. While four others alleged they were groped by him in other dance, the earliest alleged incident took place in 1992. I was just a boy. 12. Mm. The most recent in 2017, the women were in their late teens, early 20s when the incident happened. Ugh, it's just... Uh, it's not really... I don't read... How much more can we read? I, mean, yeah, yeah. I, think, I think we've got a gist, gist to, yeah. to go on with right now. Yeah. So, Lan Ray, Olubami Wo. Yes, yes. What are we yes. saying? Ha, you've heard the news. Yeah, we, yeah. What did you think? We, we've been looking to do this story for a while. Mm. Like, for whatever. Mm. We, we've had a few reasons why we haven't done it yet. But... Mm. <sighs> okay. Tim Westwood. <laughs> yeah. Tim Westwood TV. Tim yeah. Westwood, right? Yep. Uh, so I'm not a supporter of, of, of the... Uh, like, I think there's a lot of truth to these allegations. Mm. Yeah. But I think it's very important that we listen to the language that's being used here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's not make this another Jimmy Savile. Mm -hmm. Well, let's not try and make it a Jimmy Savile. Right. Yeah. So even in that article that you read, it said predatory and sexual something behavior. Mm -hmm. It's not even talking about assault or yeah. anything like that. Yeah. So this is, we had this conversation off camera, mm -hmm. us, us three, mm -hmm. where we were talking about how a lot of this, not all, but a lot of this will be, you know, Tim West would probably talk to a few girls who's come to him, um, wanted to meet some rappers maybe. Mm. And he, yeah, he's taking advantage of the situation, mm -hmm. but they're not necessarily refusing. 
Yeah. But they might be reluctant. Yeah. Mm. But not refusing. Mm -hmm. There's a big difference there. Mm -hmm. Mm. And again, I'm not saying it's right. It's not something. It's not something I would do. I don't know. It's not, not something that these boys Hell would do. No. But again, this isn't. This is what I'm saying that they shouldn't try to make this like a Jimmy Savile thing. And with the mm. BBC having the form that they do have with Jimmy Savile, mm. knowing what he was doing for years and mm. did absolutely nothing, don't try and now make this guy your scapegoat. Yeah. Which is what yeah. it's sounding like. Yeah. yeah. Do you see what I'm saying? Because, again, I'm not condoning Tim Westwood and I'm not saying he's a saint and I'm not saying he did what he did was right. Mm. And if, you know, if, if, if any wrongdoing is found... Throw the book at him. Throw the book at him. Yeah, you get you know what, what I mean? you get. But at the same time, this is nowhere on the level of a Jimmy, Jimmy Sam. Mm. Do you know what I mean? This, mm -hmm. You know, it, it's not. So I just hope that they don't try and take it to that level. Mm -hmm. That being said, again, as I said, I'm not a big fan of Tim Westwood. Mm. Never have been, to be honest with you, because he's, he felt so fake to me. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Um, so, What's yeah. What's like about me, Larry? <laughs> you know what? It's the <laughs> language. It's the language. It's like He the... tries to put on that fake American accent. Yeah. You know what I mean? And then, and then he's ingratiating himself in a, in a bad... Because I, I, I knew some people who worked behind the scenes, mm. and they always told me that he was out there getting girls for these rappers, weed, mm. alcohol. Basically, they're being a bitch. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Facilitating their nonsense, mm. you know what I mean? Because, you know, they all went on some good time, good good stuff. So, mm. like, yeah, I, that's my take on it anyway. Mm. What are your What's your take on it? Because I know Liam wants to go last because he's got players yeah, to say. Because, you know what I mean? You know, <laughs> a couple things to, to say. To be fair, as Leon mentioned really, you know, emphatically, and I think we will agree, we'll definitely agree on this about Clark, if you have done something, or sorry, sorry, rephrase that, if you've been accused of doing something, then you come out to the hills and you shout out your innocence. I want everyone and his mother to bring what you got to my front door. I'm putting it everywhere. I'm on GMTV tomorrow morning. Yeah. I'm on BBC News first, first thing on Monday. Sue. I'm going to sue. And you can literally bring whatever you want. As God is my witness, I ain't done shit. Mm -hmm. Has he come out yet and said anything against this? No. I'm on the first bit of social media I can find with my face passes everywhere. I didn't do nothing. Mm -hmm. yeah. I don't care what mm -hmm. you're saying, it ain't true. <laughs> mm -hmm. The fact he hasn't done that yet, like with what Clark, with what happened with Clark, yes. Yeah. Oh, I know my past discretions are not looked favourably upon, so I will get help. No. Yeah. You did yeah. something wrong. What were you getting help for if you haven't done anything wrong? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like, no, and he's not even gone that far yet. He's not come out and said nothing. So either yeah. he sat back right now thinking, crap, there is stuff on me. How do I spin this? Mm -hmm. Or. He's just out and out guilty. Mm -hmm. Either way, I think there's got. A, I don't want to put a blame on him. Say so he has done it, but at the moment, it's not, it's not looking has, good. It's not looking it's good. Not looking good. And to your point, Tim West has never been the kind of person that I've gravitated to. Um, you know, the way he was in the hip hop scene, I always thought it was again. It was a bit of a false bravado. Mm -hmm. I never bought into it. So yeah, I'm. I'm not looking at it in a positive light. I'm not gonna lie, Leon. How are you looking at this thing? Mm -hmm. Well, mm -hmm. Tim Westwood. I, I I never liked Tim Westwood for many years. I never liked him, and then then I did like him. Why is that? Once I got past his that's it. That was his angle. Mm -hmm. He was yeah. trying to do something different, right. and he did do something different. Mm -hmm. And he rubbed shoulders with every yeah. top hip hop act in the world from your DMXs, LL Cool J, Busta mm -hmm. Rhymes. He did something yeah. that nobody in the UK has done. Mm -hmm. yeah. And he used his own formula. Mm -hmm. And once you have a formula that works, you don't change it. Mm -hmm. yeah. So he could have come in doing that silly accent, but that's what it is. It's an act. He doesn't speak like that. Yeah. His mum, mm -hmm. he don't talk to his mum like that. Yeah. Hey yeah. mum, you know, Mm. You know what's for dinner tonight? Mm. <laughs> Drop their bombs. Tim was with TV. Like mm. he doesn't do that. Yeah, um, it's it's an act. And not only that, he he brought a lot of rap over, and then he put all the UK rappers on. Yeah, all yeah. the UK and the grime artists, the Skeptors, yeah. the BBK, the Roll Deeps, the mm. Boy But Knows. Every time I think Australia was for him. Right. Mm -hmm. All the the top grime acts and UK rappers and that mm -hmm. came through him, mm -hmm. and he put them on because mm -hmm. he gave them a platform yeah. for the world to see. Mm -hmm. Now, this whole allegations. First of all, I'm upset that people are taking so long to report these things. Mm -hmm. You need to report it straight away yeah. mm -hmm. because 
How are you going to prove? How am I going to prove that Tim Westwood squeezed my bum in 1992? Mm. How am I going to prove that? Mm. <laughs> Let me find some witness now, that was there. Now, remember what's ago. happening here. Mm. These are allegations of inappropriate behaviour, mm. but not sexual assault, assault as yeah, such. Right. Mm. It's and like, that's what all right, people. girls. So two girls have come here. He's grabbed some bums. He's like, yeah, and, let's and, take the picture. Let's, let's, let's be I, we're not saying it's right. That's not right. I'm not saying it's right. Yeah, yeah. But what I'm saying is, if you, he's always been linked to the BBC because mm -hmm. he's been on the BBC for how long now? Oh years. He's been years. on the BBC forever. Yeah. So he can be held accountable for something. Mm -hmm. He's not just a random DJ that does his own YouTube mm -hmm. channel when you can't really get him. Mm -hmm. He he's accountable. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. If I was assorted that something that their big BBC DJ plays at, yeah. I'm going to the BBC and say, yeah. you know what, this happened. And they had the whole Me Too movement. Why now is what I want to yeah. know. Yeah. And then this, how do they get, do, how long do they wait? Because they're saying it happened in 1992 and it's four allegations. Mm. How comes we're just getting four? Yeah. Why don't we get one and then two and then three and then four? Like what, how, you know, why is it? Um, Are they just un behind the scenes maybe, looking maybe, for more evidence? Well, mm. We know how that this happened with no clock because we know that there's 20 odd women that ended up. Yeah. But that was the newspaper mm. investigating themselves after one or two came to them. Mm -hmm. And they went investigating themselves and then found a whole bunch of people. Yeah. Mm. So that it could be something like that. So I'm not saying there's a no clock is any better or worse than Westwood. Mm hmm. But if no clerk can get off of 20 odd things, mm -hmm. and I'm talking taking pictures of women inappropriate in front of people, mm -hmm. Tim Westwood would have been doing these things in the dark. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah, Tim Westwood TV, like come into my hummer, mm -hmm. you know, Let, let's have a chat mm -hmm. or whatever. Or you're taking pictures and he's doing them inappropriate mm -hmm. little moves. Mm -hmm. He's not on set day in, day out where people are watching his inappropriate bit. How are you going to prove this? First of yeah, all, yeah. so I'm thinking if no clerk walks, yeah, mm, right. and there's no further nothing, mm. what's Tim Westwood? Yeah, like mm. in comparison, I'm just we're using it as a precedent, yeah, yeah as yeah, if he's yeah. going to court, yeah. So if no clerk doesn't go to court, does Tim Westwood? I, I don't think Tim Westwood will go to court, but mm -hmm. the problem is, is his the reputation court of public opinion, yeah, yeah, yeah. his career is it, done. It's done. I don't think it is, no? and I'm gonna tell you why. Go on. why? Because people see the rappers of today mm. and even the rappers of them as like, boy, it's all bitches and hoes and this and that. Mm. And da, 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 da. So what's he really in there, in the people that watch Tim Westwood, mm. what is it? And, that, and the things that he promotes, what mm. has he done? He's grabbed a few bumps and he's, he's been groping or whatever, whatever. Yeah. The slackness that he plays on Westwood mm -hmm. every Friday. Yeah. Mm. He's pretty much promoted that his whole life. Yeah. yeah. Like, bitches ain't shit. What? It's all about the what? money. What? I don't think he'll be on the BBC or anything. No, he won't no. be on the BBC. But I do think his career is going to diminish. And I'll tell you why. Because what you have to remember is mm. society was different then. Mm -hmm. Society yeah. is different now. Yeah. And and that and that's the biggest thing. I think, yeah. Thing I don't right. think it is. If Takeshi69 yeah. can get done for... Pedophilia, yeah. snitch, yeah. go and make everyone and go never, to jail. I've never understood that. As and well. still come out and make money the same way he went is he in. He's still making music. Yeah. But I think the thing with Takeshi is it is it right? No, but no. his one is he, he's been, Oh, he should be in that, that that that. How is he not cancelled? That's what I'm and that's the point you I'm know, making. You know People what? like you that these point. days. Yeah. Tim Westwood could go on and make his own YouTube you channel tomorrow you know and I bet you he's got a hundred K followers you know and he'll make his own money. Very good point. Yeah. I, I didn't yeah. think of Takeshi, but yeah. just for example, yeah. and yeah. he's nasty. Oh. To, to and he's a point, little I think, weasel. I think to Larry's point, I think the BBC will drop him. Yeah. But he will go something like YouTube yeah. and he'll make his yeah. own following yeah. from there. Because he'll draw all the ones that want to still shins, but watch my BBC. He'll draw him to that platform. Yeah. And I think that's akin to what Takeshi's done because even though Takeshi isn't on a channel, 
No. He went, did he go to the same label or a different label? I'm not sure. But, like, but they he, still signed him. You'll still, he'll, still see him. I didn't know any Yeah, you'll still see him on the Breakfast Club and this mm, and doing wow. interviews here, there, and everywhere. And he's still getting millions of hits. Millions. I think he's pedophilia crap. Yes. he. He filmed it as well, basically him and because even what's her face knew about it. Nicki Minaj knew about it yeah. at the time. Yeah, he, before she done the tune with him. Was she like a thirteen year old girl? I don't, girl? I don't and know. And he's not in jail that? because of that. No, because he played it off. He didn't her age. So, she but they can, they, yeah, it, it, that it, doesn't matter. No, no, no. You know, you know what? It's a long story, but mm. the point, but, uh, the that, point remains that he's done that. Well, and, this yeah. did, and the this, women this, are still throwing themselves at him. To my point, and I think it's quite well known that. Takeshi works with the government. That 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 is, and and when you yeah. work with the government, you get away with a lot of stuff. Not only that, when you make money, yeah, but in, in this case, this yeah. is uh, no. I get what you're saying. Yeah, but he snitched. Like yeah, of course, he snitched. He he he. he, he Do you working, think he ain't got security? He's working with Yo, the he, government. He's got FBI oh, agents. Yeah, he, that's why he's watching his back. Yet. That's why he hasn't been blamed. <laughs> he would have been in the ground a long time. Oh, long ago. long time ago. You I, imagine I if he would have come out of prison? No. no. Do you know what I mean? No, if he was broke. If he was broke mm. and wasn't as popular, he'd mm. never leave prison. Mm. Mm. But the whole thing, and he just like threw yeah. everyone under the F bus. F yeah, yeah, yeah. Everyone under the, the bus. FBI have got his of back. course, they got his yeah, back. His back. Snipes, They're the biggest gang in the world. Snipes went to prison for literally just not paying a tax bill. <laughs> Takeshi, paedophilia, murder. Snitching on other people, and then you can come out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. A career back. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, here you go. So yeah. Back to Tim Westwood. So I don't think I no, don't. You make you make a good point. And Tim Westwood. How old is Tim Westwood? I mean, it's, it's, it's an old man. Fifty. Yeah. Old he's man. in his sixties, bro. How old is Tim Westwood? Is it? Is a big old man? Mm. How wait? How old is Tim Westwood? Sixty-four <laughs> years old. Are you right. right. 64. Big old man. So you know what? Even if his career's done today, he's sixty-four he's to write in. Do you know how rich? He's made, he's made money. Do you know how much money that brother has? Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah? yeah. He was driving Hummers before they mm -hmm. were even imported in this country. Mm -hmm. I remember his big yellow Tim Westwood Hummer, mm -hmm. and this is back day when I was like all ninety eights, ninety nines. He's been doing this for um, for forever, so yeah. it, he's not over. Yeah, uh, unless the only the, and even that is. Is it just allegations of inappropriate behaviour? That's what I'm mm. saying. Didn't Donald Trump say he drag up the woman by the pump? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, and he still became yeah, president. Yeah, yeah. Mm, bro. But <laughs> let me ask you this then. Let me ask you two this then. Yeah. And I know the answer before I even ask <laughs> so it. So why ask it? Just, just, just so because. Audience can yeah. Okay. Okay. If this was a black man, I done out here. Be, would you be done out here? <laughs> done out here. <laughs> He's not even got a trial date. It's like you, you're, you're due in that, prison yeah. tomorrow, young man. Like I'm I'm just being real. I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm not trying to. No, but I any, think about it now. I'm just being real. No clock is dead. Like, oh, he's done. Yeah, he's, he's done. done. Yeah. He's done. Yeah. He's yeah. done at yeah. here, yeah. Done. and he hasn't got one conviction. Mm -hmm. No, mm -hmm. he's he caught by a public opinion, like mm -hmm. he said. Mm -hmm. He's dead out here. Mm -hmm. Tim Westwood, Tim, if Tim Westwood wants Listen. to come back, he's back tomorrow. And, 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 he and stepped and, down and because be... he's got a relationship with the BBC and they've said, look, Tim, we, we'll say you step down. Yeah. We need yeah. to be seen yeah. as doing something. He's like, already yeah. The other one. Yeah, yeah, he's yeah, like, yeah. Tim's like, I know the deal. Do you know what I mean? Let's just make it amicable. Yeah. If it blows over, you know, yeah. you're our guy. You can come back. Exactly. <laughs> you know it. And a good, a good example of that over the pond of being white and getting away with it, mm. we don't have to see Mel Gibson. You know, if a black person did what he did, mm. you are not coming back. Mm -hmm. You're done. Mm. You're At here. Done. And, and <coughs> you know what I mean? But he gets another chance. Mm -hmm. So it, it, it just... Look at the latest one. Ezra's running the band in Hawaii still. Ezra Miller! Right, right. right. Ezra Miller. Yeah. If, mm. if, if, if that was Wesley Snipes... <laughs> Brocking up couples, it'd be dead. It'd be dead. It'd be dead. It'd be dead, bro. That's, That's what I'm saying. So this I, is I, reality. Self defense. The officer pulled the gun. What we had. He'd be the martial artist as well. Yeah. yeah. Oh, he, he had a weapon. What his hand yeah. was raised. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Done. He said, "I'm done. sorry." Yeah. Done. yeah. Absolutely done. But listen, I, I, yeah. yeah. It, yeah. We it it may turn out to be more. But we're, I'm just going on the information the I have now. at this moment. Yeah. If you have any more, 
then we'll follow it up. We'll mm -hmm. do another show. We'll we'll speak more. I'm just saying, with the evidence that they've given so far, there's not much they can do with yeah. that. Yeah. And but who knows? Who knows? Mm -hmm. I'm sure Tim Westwood ain't going to jail though. No, but I don't think so. Let us know what you think. Leave a a like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>